All right, time now for our Royal Watch with our Royal commentator, Victoria Arbiter. Welcome back, Victoria. Great to see you, and it's been a royally busy few days, Kristen. Okay, we're all on Royal Baby Bump Watch. So what's the latest with Prince Harry and Meghan Markle? Well, as you say, with the world officially on Royal Baby Bump Watch, Harry and Meghan are continuing their 16-day tour down under. Their jam-packed schedule includes 76 engagements spread across four countries, marking Meghan's first international tour as a member of the royal family. Now, the couple started in Sydney, where they met koalas at the world-famous Taronga Zoo before greeting well-wishers, thousands of well-wishers in the shadow of Sydney Opera House. In the drought-hit community of Dubbo, they brought the rain and they met a new best friend, an adorable five-year-old Luke Vincent, who was big on cuddles and stroking Harry's beard. On Friday, Harry climbed to the top of Sydney Harbour Bridge to raise the Invictus Games flags and the Games officially opened over the weekend. This week, Harry and Meghan continue on to Fiji, Tonga and New Zealand. That little boy was everything. Seriously, how cute is he? Okay, so Harry can't get all the attention. What has Prince William been up to? Well, back at home, Prince William hosted a reception at Buckingham Palace for the brave British divers and their support teams who contributed to the search and rescue of those 12 young soccer players and their coach from a cave in Thailand last July. Now, meeting with the divers firsthand, William was able to hear of their harrowing yet thankfully successful search and rescue mission. The reception was hosted in association with Search and Rescue England and Wales, for which William is patron. Victoria, thanks so much for the inside information, and we'll see you next week.